Hi guys, this is Dr. Ahmed Ergin. Today I'm going to talk to you about which type of diabetes is more dangerous. Let's get started. Before we do that, I'm going to introduce myself. I'm Dr. Ahmed Ergin. I'm an endocrinologist and see uh, I have a lot of patients in my clinic and I love educating my patients. That's why we do these videos. If you like them, please subscribe, please share this video uh, and spread the word. Now, which one is more dangerous? Which one is more dangerous? I would say type 2. And here's why. Type 1 diabetics, if they are actually good type 1 diabetics, if they know what they're doing, if their blood sugar is under control, they will never have problem with their diabetes. Yes, it's inconvenient. Yes, they have to take insulin all the time, etc., etc. But the bottom line is, they will, as long as they manage it well, the chances of complications from type 1 diabetes is very low. Um, as long as they keep their A1C down and so forth. Now with type 2 diabetes, on the other hand, by the time they get diagnosed, they have typically something called insulin resistance. Now, insulin resistance is the main problem. Uh, diabetes comes later. Now, insulin resistance is the main reason why a lot of diabetics end up having heart attacks and strokes, why they end up losing so many years from their life, even if their diabetes is well controlled. So, uh, of course, if it is not well controlled, they're going to suffer way more. Uh, but sometimes by the time they have a diagnosis of diabetes, they already have underlying cardiovascular disease. They already have underlying neuropathy. They already have underlying eye disease, sometimes even kidney disease. So nowadays we catch diabetes pretty early, thankfully, with the screenings and all that uh, good stuff. But definitely uh, a lot of type 2 diabetics, when they get diagnosed, uh, if it is a slow process, they tend to uh, push it away or put, get into a denial uh, and they don't control it for the first five ten years until their blood sugars go really out of whack and then they or, or, on, or they start having complications they hit the wall and they start saying oh well maybe I should do something uh, so when when that is the case they already have a lot of complications established by 10 to 15 years into diabetes and uh, still important to control diabetes at that stage but uh, they are fairly late in the game uh, so I, that's why you know I would not wait to control your diabetes especially if you have type 2 if you're a pre-diabetes I would definitely definitely uh, take aggressive measures to reduce my cardiovascular risk if it was me uh, I would definitely change my entire lifestyle I would uh, do everything to prevent progression to diabetes um, and so forth if you're a smoker quit smoking change your alcohol habits uh, etc so that is going to be your a pivoting point, uh, inflection point. Uh, if you don't do that, you're going to be way too late. As a result, guys, type 2 diabetes is way more dangerous than type 1 diabetes. I hope that answers your question. And for the next video, we will see you. Have a great day.